वेलकम टू नव क्लासेस टुडे आई एम गोना टीच यू हाउ टू सॉल्व स्क्वायर रूट्स विद मैट्रिक्स सो फॉर नंबर्स व्हिच आर नॉट परफेक्ट स्क्वायर्स सो इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी डिस्कस्ड हाउ टू सॉल्व स्क्वायर रूट्स सो दीज आर द परफेक्ट स्क्वायर्स लाइक फोर और व्हिच वी आर एबल टू मेक पेयर्स लाइक दिस एंड दिस स्क्वायर ऑफ व्हिच आर हैविंग वन एट द एंड फॉर वन एंड फॉर फोर स्क्वायर आर हैविंग फोर एट द एंड so these are perfect squares and others which are not able to bifurcate it into pairs in two pairs so we call them non perfect squares so there is different technique to solve them there is different trick to solve them so i'm going to teach you that today so there is one which is common for both non perfect and perfect squares that is zero so if you see that zero is perfect and as well as not perfect for example if we see for a uh, square root of 1600 it is perfect square it is having zero at the end and it is perfect square because we can uh, derive its square straight away but in case of 2000 root square it is not perfect square so we have to use a formula to solve it so today i'm going to teach you how to solve it with formula firstly if you didn't subscribe yet then please do subscribe the number at the end 0 2 3 7 8 are non perfect squares and at the end if there is 1 4 5 6 Nine. These are perfect squares. So, formula to solve this non-perfect square is uh, we are going to calculate it with help of formula. If you want to know about perfect squares trick, you just visit my previous video. Link is given in description box. So, how do we solve the square root for non-perfect squares? at the end so let we discuss about this formula this is firstly we should know about the nearest square root we are going to consider what is the nearest square root and then we are going to plus uh, questions uh, root square which is given subtract nearest root square and divide it by 2 multiplied by nearest square which we got okay so let's take an example if you are willing to get uh, this is root of 2000 so we are going to get its square okay so are willing to get its square so how to get it this is non perfect so nearest square root we are going to calculate if we see 1600 is perfect square so 1600 is nearest square root here we are going to consider the smaller nearest square root so which is lesser than or equal to 2000 so lesser than is 1600 so firstly see the nearest square root which is 1600 and it its square root is 40 okay so we write down this in the formula 40 plus questions root square in question we are given 2000 root square subtracted by nearest root square 1600 divided by 2 multiplied by nearest square which we derived is 40 okay so now we are going to solve it after solving we will be able to get the answer see 40 plus 400 divided by 2 multiplied by 40 is 80 okay so we are going to solve it then it will 40 plus 5 is 45 answer in this manner you will be able to solve any questions are having non perfect squares at the end like 0 okay so now we are going to take another example for any digit having 0 2 3 7 8 at the end okay so so the only thing you require to know is nearest square root the smaller nearest square root and then we are able to solve our equation easily okay so nearest square root is must for example the question asks for 47 root square so the nearest square root for 47 is we are going to consider the lesser one somewhat lesser one then 47 is 36 root is equal to 6 so nearest square root we get is 6 here so just write down this 6 here 
uh, we are going to put this nearest square root in the formula 6 plus near uh, this root square given in the question is 47 minus our nearest root square divided by 2 multiplied by nearest square we got okay now we are going to solve it it comes 6 plus 11 divided by 12 if we solve it 12 multiplied by 6 is 72 plus 11 divided by 12 okay so now it is easy to solve 83 divided by 12 so this can be the answer if this is not given in options then you have to solve it further so 6.91 is answer for root square 47 so here we are able to consider it easily and get our answer in easier manner so keep watching now classes now we understood how to solve not perf non perfect squares check out my previous lectures for other tricks like squares and cubes so links are given in description box next i'm going to teach you cubes and cube root tricks and then we will discuss some re reasoning in our next lectures so keep watching the classes subscribe like and share my videos with your friends thank you